So we out here at Rafa's garage. Um, I'm gonna start parting this car out. Headlights are gonna be for sale. I'm gonna take them off. Uh, lip, I'm gonna keep. Rims are going into my car right for now. Um, rims are going there. And these rims are going to my girl's car and my girl's cars are going on to this. Taking out the brake, brake kit. Uh, that one's mine. Molly side skirts, I'm gonna take them off. Let's see how much I get done today. Hopefully a lot. Um, it's already like five in the afternoon. But the reason I'm starting late is cause it's hot as hell in California right now. So was waiting there for it to go down. Now it has time to work. Headlights and bumpers off. So now I'm gonna take off the side markers and this roller lip. Super rare. So I'm gonna keep that. And these side markers are only size eight, right there. Uh, and the Waller lip, bunch of tans somewhere there. And that's it. So lip is off, bumper is off. I actually had some extra side marker stocks for my girl's car luckily she kept them so now i'm gonna start taking out the suspension the coils the rims and the big brake kit right now mm. the brake big kit um basically it has two bolts one right here one over here and it has a bracket so it's actually four one two three four to take off this and the other thing you have to take off also is this line right here so over here it connects and i believe i don't know what size is it but we're gonna take that line and this brake big kit is gonna come out and then the this should come off while i was doing this taking off the pole over my girl took off the side skirts as you can see these are the brackets for the mollies and the molly side skirts are on top of the car already so we're gonna take off the coals and finish it off so to take off this one you just take off a size 10 with the wrench and then this you're gonna use some pliers and just pull it off and this line should come off make sure you have a bucket down there because you're gonna start leaking brake fluid so I have it already there or a drip pan whatever it is and that's it come off I tried hammering it that's why you see a lot of the little dancing here um, when this doesn't happen it's because there's a bunch of rust around here so what we do is put two little screws here and then start tightening it up tightening it up and then eventually it's gonna push it out into until it comes off that's why these little things are here so if you have two screws usually these are like common very common size 12 or 10s and that's it. That's what these holes are meant for. And it should come out. That's it. So the brakes are out. Same thing for the disc. Uh, coal is out. As you can see, it's already like everything taken apart. Now we're just gonna put the stock suspension on it and that's it. He was running some spacers on it. I didn't like it because he had two. So, Hopefully I don't have to run these for the big brake kit, but if I have to, I'll run them, but if not, we'll see. So we put a stop right here. Um, just put the stock suspension, the stock brakes. The lights are out, the lip is out. 
So, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you guys another day.